Colorado is waiting, waiting for its newest residents to arrive home. It's not easy and it takes years. It's just, it's not an event for people to be resettled. It's a process. An estimated 1,500 refugees who fled the Taliban in Afghanistan will arrive in Denver over the coming months to start their new life in America. We have something special here. The state is really invested in supporting refugees. Denver is one of 19 cities across the country chosen by the State Department as the best places for Afghan refugees to resettle. Yes. Jennifer Wilson is the executive director of the International Rescue Committee in Denver, an organization that helps refugees adjust to life in the U.S. If you don't have a tie that's identified, if you don't have a family member or a friend that you're looking to join, you can choose from this list of cities. And when you do that, then you are eligible to receive services and support. Denver was chosen for a variety of reasons, including job opportunities, the prevalence of established refugee communities in the area, and housing. Housing is a huge issue, and, you know, it's not terribly affordable here, but also we do find that because there are jobs and jobs do tend to be higher paying, that people are able to make it work. It's also on the list because it's known as a welcoming community. Just a few. You can see that through the boxes of donations stacked up in Jennifer's office. A lot of the items that you'll see that have been donated are, you know, the things that you need to set up a home when you're arriving with nothing or very little. As they collect donations, they also wait. Wait to welcome everyone home. It's a bit of a long road that we have ahead still. The clock is ticking, right? We know people will be coming very soon and in significant numbers. The first Afghans who have fled the Taliban have already arrived in Colorado over the past couple of weeks with plenty more set to arrive over the coming months. Of course, from there, they'll work to call Denver home with plenty of people here ready to welcome them. Alex, we have information on our website on how to help those refugees.